I'm just out skating on route to Canary Wharf and I've spotted an epic mural I want to share with you because it is in itself an important piece of social and political history. Executed between 1976 and 1983, this piece measures a whopping 17 by 18 metres and commemorates the Battle of Cable Street, which took place exactly 86 years ago today, on the 4th of October 1936, when Sir Oswald Mosley and his British Union of Fascists led a march down Cable Street, an area with an established Jewish community. But unfortunately for Mosley, 250,000 East Londoners turned out to send the fascists packing. And this mural captures every drop of energy, anger, violence, resistance and struggle between protesters and police who'd been dispatched to protect Mosley's marches. It was initially painted by the artist Dave Binnington and later taken on by artists Paul Butler, Desmond Rochefort and Ray Walker, whose style is perhaps most visible. But all of these artists were at least in part inspired by Diego Rivera and Mexican mural painting, a tradition rooted in telling stories of ordinary human struggle. But also, to my eye, at least, there's a stylistic nod to one of my favourite modernist British artists, Edward Burrow, who's best known for his depictions of the urban underworld, jazz culture and the Harlem scene of the 1930s and whose work would have been very well known to all of these Cable Street muralists. I'd love you to come and see this piece for yourselves. It's an absolute belter. It's jam-packed with extraordinary details. It's on the side of St George's Town Hall in Shadwell. And if you know anyone that wants to come and see this piece too, please tag them in the comments so we can all share the love. See ya.